Whole Miami alien situation has just completely blown out of the water and today I have actually received a message from one of the witnesses that I featured in our video covering this um, who came out to kind of speak about their experiences who said that they would like to have a chat with me with you guys as well and kind of an exclusive interview to give their in-depth detailed uh, story about the entire alien situation and we're going to be putting some questions to them um, I don't think I've seen anyone do this yet so this could be the first time on YouTube that someone's done this with one of the uh, with one of the um, witnesses but I'm very very excited it is King Sosa who had this statement man, what's up y'all I'm here to set the record straight man like I literally have been getting interrogated by the Miami Police Department for days, my dude. I look, look at me. <laughs> um, it is really aliens. It's really aliens. And I cannot believe that the Miami Police Department is really gonna try to make it seem like they had all those car police cars and stuff out there over some kids fighting, y'all. We talking about three and four blocks. We get in, we, they asked us, first they asked us what we saw. It was me, two of my cousins, and one of my homegirls. All three of us being basically locked the fuck up. I ain't trying to get in trouble or nothing like that, but I'm just telling y'all, man. This shit is so real, man. Like, everybody saw it. There will be more reports coming out. There will be more reports coming out on this, man. But I just want to go on record and speak my truth. You know, they asked us not to speak about it. Any any blog site, any news site, anybody who wants to talk to me, please get in my DM, man. Because that's the only way I'm going to tell my whole truth. But I just want to let y'all know, man. Aliens are real. It was three of them. And we couldn't believe it. Y'all like this video. Get this video trending, and I post my own cell phone footage. They tried to actually take my cell phone footage. You know what I'm saying? I showed them that, thinking that I'm helping the world. They trying to get, they trying to delete it. But once you delete something on your phone, they have recent delete, recently deleting. You have to put your password in. I wasn't able to, I wasn't willing to get them that. So. And y'all get this video to where it need to be, and I'm going I'm, I'm, I'm to go crazy. And also released this footage of the supposed alien creatures. On the way. This is how our interview went. Instagram, all that. Shout out to you, man. So I heard about you through my homeboy. My homie, he was like, yeah, my homie was like, man, I just I seen you on this um YouTuber page and I was like, what? So I went to it and I checked you. I was like, oh man, he cool. I gotta get him an interview. But I man, I don't even wanna, I don't even wanna, I don't even wanna bull crap around right now because really I've really been up in my comments all night. So I got a lot of things I want to get off my chest. You know what I mean? Because the internet is undefeated, man. <laughs> the internet, man, no matter what you show the internet. You're always going to have your people to say, it's true, it's not true. You know what I'm saying? You really can't, you really, you really can't beat them. So um, at first, when I first put the footage on the internet, I was kind of skeptical and stuff. I was like, man, I don't know how people going to take this. But but once I see that I cannot, I cannot beat the internet, trust me, I just feel so much better, bro. <laughs> Honestly, man, I've been doing this a little while. And if there's one thing that I can tell you, it's that the internet, you, like you say, you can't beat it. Right? No. Like you no. couldn't you can yeah. put out one fire and then ten other fires will start up. It doesn't matter. But, oh yeah, um, that's 
they no. definitely coming for you. But hey, where where are you coming? Uh, where are you from right now? Where are you um uh, streaming from right now? I'm in the UK. I'm in um just uh, up in Newcastle. Okay, man. I'm in Charlotte, North Carolina. So yo, shout out to you, man. Word up. Hey, but look though, what we're not gonna do, man. We gotta jump right into this. what we're not gonna do is try to make. And I don't understand why they did this, but what we're not gonna do is try to make the black teens of Miami look like some animals just running around and you had to call the whole Vice City PD and I keep on saying Vice City PD you yeah. know what I'm saying to come out there for that which is just crazy man you yeah. know what I'm saying so I took the teams in Miami to start the new to start the new year off like that with that negative image on them like that I don't think that was right you know what I mean no I think you know obviously that was the whole cover up supposed cover up is that uh <laughs> You know, it was never aliens. It was always it was a what? What did they say? It was fireworks set off in the mall. Which yeah, but then... yeah, I, hold on. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Yeah, Have on. you seen any videos with any fireworks? No. Yeah, I know. I, I haven't seen any videos of any fireworks. I haven't seen any smoke. Now, what is your first thing that you're gonna do when you see fireworks? Are you gonna look at them? Nah. You're not gonna look at fireworks if you see them. Oh, if I see off? them, yeah. If I hear them, different story. Because that's what a lot of people are saying is they thought they okay, heard gunfire. But, yeah, but if you see them, you're gonna start looking. You're gonna start filming yeah, too. You're Who gonna like, like this is this is the thing that a lot of people have been saying. Everyone's like, if you see fights, everyone records fights, posts them because sometimes they go viral. Yeah, but no one recorded it, and that's what yeah, people exactly. are kind of. So why are you why why are you trying to say there's gangs in Miami? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's start there. We. Do, I don't, I don't understand why they're trying to say it's gangs in Miami starting fights. But what I can say is this, man. A lot of people got on their phone and they called 911 because they saw aliens. That's real. I saw three of them. So, and I'm here to tell y'all. I'm yeah. here to tell y'all right now. That's real. So, and and the footage that the footage that I have posted on my on my um TikTok, you need to go over there and check that out. I've Look seen it. Before. I've seen it. It's the um the one from outside where there was the air shot view, which went viral, and then there was yeah. your footage, which was from outside, kind of side yeah. on. Right now, that's why I posted. That's why I posted my footage because I seen the. I seen. I literally woke up and I seen that they had posted the air shot footage of this, and I was mind blown. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. I was like, they just show aliens on TV. You know what I'm saying? Like really, just showing it on TV. So when I see people was trying to say it's three cops, I said, oh man. Boom! I posted the footage to from my burner account. I did it that I did it that way first because you know what I'm saying. I didn't want people to be like, you know, man, this is fake and all that. But once I seen that my burner account, the people were still in the footage. I posted it from my real account, and that's when it went how it went. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, I know what you're saying. Yeah. And so to kind of go back to the very beginning. All right. So what? So this was January first, right? Yeah. You're at Miami Mall, or is it Bayside? Bayside Mall. Yeah, but we don't even want to say we don't even want to say the name. We just gonna say we was at a mall. At a mall. You know, we, no we outside. We, we, yeah, we were, we we were, we were outside. You know, the whole people keep on thinking that this place has like 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 a top on it. It doesn't have a top on it, so it's like a a, a, a marketplace, like they Got say. You, you know, okay. I mean. Yeah. Anyway, so everybody was just chilling. Now, mind you, man, it was more than just black teens out there. I keep on saying that, man. It was a mixture of everybody out there having a good time. Like I said, everybody was chilling. And um, the first thing that I seen was a whole bunch of police. And I was trying to figure out what's going on with that. You know what I mean? Because it was like a bunch of them coming. And then the next thing I know, I hear people running and going. It's chaotic, just going crazy. And people are saying that they see aliens. It's aliens. It's aliens. But we were in the back, so we ran to the front, and that's when you see my footage that I caught. And I do have more footage that I am gonna drop. But like I said, man, this I don't know how long they were actually out there, but I got like a good minute of it. Wow. Okay. Cool. As soon as I, soon as I yeah, as soon as I, well, it was me, my two cousins, and my homegirl. As soon as I came around the front, that's when we um. Uh, that's when I got that footage, man. And for all the people saying, it's, for all the people saying recorded with a potato and it's never clear footage, let's think, man. You know, this, why, why is everybody's footage always the same? Now, my phone does have a crack on it, but I mean, why is everybody's footage always the same? This is bigger than, this is bigger than Aliens in Miami, man. This goes all the way back where I'm thinking is Roswell. Now, I did talk to somebody um, last night. Y'all had a real good conversation with somebody who explained to me what I saw. Like, what I saw was 
three tall, dark figures walking down the street and they faded out and not only video clip that i haven't posted is them actually fading out now people were wow. saying maybe they walked into a portal like that but this is what i've been saying since day one i think this is something out the ocean because it was black and shiny like people keep on saying it's a shadow and it and that's how it looks on 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 footage but when i seen it it just looks shiny and um the, the, the source that i talked to last night say that man these things come out the ocean I was asking them, well, why are they so tall? And they were saying, well, from where they're from, that's, you know, they're they're tall. That's where they're from. That's how they're made, where they're from. Like, man, I'm just getting, I'm just diving into this um, whole, I'm just diving into this whole thing before I didn't have no knowledge on it. And my whole plan to do with my platform is to progress and build a community where we all can get more information and definitely get the um, government to say that, you know, they need to go ahead and disclose this thing, man. You got people like Jeremy Corbell and a lot of people who's already then came out and, um, you know, speaking upon this, man. So we just need to go ahead and boom, you know what I'm saying? Get, yeah. this, get, get this over and done with, man. You know what I'm saying? So the world can move on. Like I said, I, I, I the world is calling the alien, so I'm going with calling the alien. You know what I'm saying? I can't say what they are. So when people in the comments telling me that's not aliens, whatever, man, I'm going with it. the world is yeah, already yeah, calling. Yeah. But the world is already calling. You know what I mean? Yeah. All I know is that my footage is real. You have to go to Little Too Much 704. You have to subscribe to Hood TV Experts on YouTube, man. I'm telling you. And then this is this is something that I'm that I'm understanding too, man. Um. If you go to any Apple Music, Spotify, or anything like that, type in King Sosa, 8 a.m. in Charlotte. I'm also an artist. But what I'm going to start doing is dropping audio of what i seen and stuff like that on audio so it could be on Spotify and, you know, every platform like that. Because my platform is very small right now. And, you know, I'm trying to get my message out there. Uh, quick, and I know I've already have a fan base with my music, so you know I'm 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 doing that. So y'all make sure y'all check in for that. But um, yeah, man, like I said, I just really feel like you know um, we shouldn't be blaming this on no kids. There's no footage. There's no footage of a whole lot of fights. You know what I'm saying? I I did see one footage of fight. I did hear uh, the news say that four teams were arrested. You know, but that was it. But to try to sweep everything under the rug like how they always do, bro. That's how they always do. They, that one big thing comes out, they put something else out, and they flood and they flood you with a whole bunch of other stuff. Right. You know what I'm saying? To yeah. make you forget about it. And that's why I'm saying that's why my platform is here for the people who want to keep on keep keep pushing with me. Who there's somebody that's relatable to y'all? Because a lot of people who actually speak on this subject, I don't feel like. They might have, might not have the swagger or whatnot to make people lean towards this. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I'm adding a, a different dynamic to that, and uh, yeah, that's what I want to pursue, yo. Word up, man. Fair enough. I mean, so describe what it was. Like, obviously, we've got loads of people saying that it was three tall figures. It wasn't a statue. <laughs> it, yeah, a lot of people saying it was statues. Whatever. But what? <laughs> How would you describe it? If you were to describe it right now, what you witnessed, what would you describe it as? I would describe it as tall, dark, and shiny. Shiny. That see, that's it. That's the different piece from your kind of account to everyone else. Everyone else is like shadowy, kind of dark, tall. How tall yeah. are we talking? Like, because there's been uh, varies. Hey, hey, listen. If you look at my video, that like I said, it's on a little too much seven hundred four on TikTok. If you look at my video, man, you can actually see. The buildings, I don't know if those are condos, I don't know if those are apartments. But if you look, and that should give you, I, I'm not good at feet and stuff like that. You know, I'm not the type of person that can say, oh yeah, that's a 10 footer, or you know, yeah, something yeah, like that. Yeah. I'm, I'm not that type of person, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm telling you, if you look at the footage, you will see this thing is up there. <laughs> this thing is up there by people's windows. And I feel like those are the people who call by City PD. Shout out to Rockstar, man. This has to be on GTA 6, man. Y'all make sure y'all sure share y'all make sure y'all share this YouTube, man. Y'all make sure y'all share this, man. We got to get this out here, man. The, uh, I mean, it's funny you should say that because everyone in the comments is talking about GTA 6 and how this man, is, this is all going to be a part of it. But Yeah, they ought to have me and you on there, man. Like oh, I said, I'll be Rockstar, honest. Bro. I hey, mean, I will be thrilled. Vice City. Hey, look. Vice City. Um, aliens in Vice City. Let's go, man. Let's do it. So, yeah. 
I mean, one comment I've got a lot of, so I've, I've kind of briefly yeah, kind of said that we've got stuff uh, happening. One comment that came up a lot was people asking what it smelled like. Did there, was I, there, I mean, obviously you're outside. No, there was no smell in the air, and there was no sound because it was flooded by a cop cars, man. I yeah. <laughs> and then you can actually, you can actually hear, you know what I'm saying, whispers of them. Uh, did you see it? Did you see it? Did you see it? Oh, you know, real. of the, of the Vice City asking each other amongst themselves, did you see it? But Ooh. man, they will never release no body cameras, and they they never release none of that type. I of mean, stuff, I saw some footage yesterday of. Mm-hmm. Uh, someone who was a- around some police officers at the time, and over the radio, they were referring to creatures. I'm saying, man, that's what I'm saying. That's 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 why you got to go look at my video and be the judge for yourself. Get in the comments, man, because the algorithm is crazy and the engagement is crazy on there, man. You could get in there and you could really tell your opinion. Make sure that y'all send me any links that I need to do my own history on. Like I said, bro. Bro, I'm tr- I'm trying to figure this thing out with the rest of America. You know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. just trying to tell you. I'm just trying to tell you what I saw. Now, now a lot of people are trying to figure out how do I feel after this and all that. Man, I have a whole life that has to go on. Bills still have to go on, and that's still gonna have to go on even as, as even after they um, admit that these things are real. But what I think will will happen if they do admit these things are real and they do decide to show these beings i feel like they will be putting them on tour and they'll be trying to make money off of it that's what i think oh, okay. you know what I'm yeah that's my that's my take on it right that's that's my take on it but you know man it's it's just way too much it's just way too much evidence out there to knock anybody you know what i'm saying i'm not i'm not trying to pressure nobody to believe what i'm saying or nothing i know people are going to, like i said the internet is undefeated um and in in real life i'm a real cool laid back down to um earth person you know what i'm saying um very nice you know what i mean and i'm just trying to tell y'all i would not get on here and tell y'all something that i did not see so there it goes bro fair enough i mean yeah the other things that people have claimed to witness is um portals uh apparently you know these portal things opened up they're dipping in and out of it whatever (laughs) fading in and out of like okay. I shot. What did like, you witness anything like that? No, but but um if you go to UFO God, man, it's a it's a dude on TikTok named UFO God, man. I talked to him last night, bro. I mean, this dude is has 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 major knowledge on this. He's probably gonna be uh one of the biggest people that I can probably say on TikTok who um that that can talk about this uh whole alien thing, but he went into detail with me um, last night saying that uh, there was like three Latino guys that was on the backside part of uh, where the water is and some about they opened up a portal and it was like some rocks or something. It's like three rocks or something like that. It was, I mean, it was three of them and it was like some rocks. I want to get his numbers mixed up with that and something happened like through the water like i'm trying to tell you that's why i kept on saying if you ever if you've been following my whole thing man i've been saying it looked like it was wet i keep saying it looks like it was wet it looks like it was wet like it came out the ocean you know what i'm saying um and and that and when he told me that last night i was like yo that makes perfect sense now let me add now let me tell y'all something that um he also said about this portal um um with the guys and it's 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 coming through the water he broke it down to me like this. If a fish gets out of the water, it's gonna have a certain amount of time to breathe, all right? So these beings, when they got out the water, they had only a certain time to be out of that water. You understand what I'm right. saying? Yeah, yeah. Because because from what I've been told that this stuff is actually like in, in the ocean. And it's already been confirmed I don't know if y'all seen the video about the girl who did the coordinates with the Antarctica. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the the comments are going so wild about that. Shout out to everybody who's uh, concerned about the Epstein list too, man, because they will not get out my comments with that. You know what I mean? They mm. try, they trying to say that this is a, this is a distraction uh, to the Epstein list. First of all, uh, man, we want to go on record. We want to say anybody who is engaging in any of those kind of activities we're not trying to distract the world from none of that those people should go where they should where they where they deserve to go so yep. that's what we're going to say about that man 
You know what I mean? But yeah, man, what was the what was what was told to me is that the three dudes they um they 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 did open up a portal, man, and I can't confirm that. I cannot confirm that, bro. Okay. But all I know is that this guy sound really convincing. He sound yeah. really convincing, man. You know me, I was trying to get the hell on about my business, bro. I was yeah. trying, I was, you know what I'm talking about. So I mean, man, like I said, my I, I can't really. I can't really tell y'all too much. I can just tell y'all what I believe, and I can just tell y'all what I seen. Like, but like I said, bro, yeah. my the, my footage that I've already been putting out is uh is basically they, they, they. I mean, you know, basically people are feeling some type of way about it, so it's making me not want to put out no more until I actually know that I actually know that my platform are full of people who want to go this way with it, and then I can go how I need to go with it. You know, I'm very I'm a Virgo, bro, so I, I analyze everything and I, I structure everything different. I move different. This is not going to be some sloppy stuff with me where I'm just throwing stuff on the internet. You know what I'm talking about? Because I'm going to control my narrative. You go know ahead. what I'm saying? Nobody's going to control it for me. I'm going to control my narrative, and I'm gonna I'm gonna put the information out there how I want to do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Either way, either way it goes, the people that want to receive it are going to receive it, and the people that don't, they're not going to want to receive it, bro. Completely but all fair. I can say is that the internet is, the internet is undefeated, and I want to I wanna thank everybody who's uh, sending so much kind things to my messenger, asking me, am I okay? Man, I'm feeling great. You know what I'm talking about? I got three beautiful daughters. You know what I mean? They're doing good. I'm taking care of them. Life is going on. And uh, man, I'm gonna continue to keep on talking about this, man. But I'm gonna have to get out of here. I'm gonna have to get out of here in a minute, man. You got anything else that you could think of that you might want to ask? Yeah, there's there are a couple more things, just very quickly. So one thing is, um, people are asking about noises. Obviously, it was probably quite chaotic, sirens, people screaming, yeah. shouting, whatever. Did these things make yeah. any noise? No, that's why you heard with sirens and um, that's all you heard with sirens and stuff. Like I said, man, I think that they were just observing. And like I said, I'm I'm going I'm gonna jump on the shit with everybody else with the coordinate things. That's what I think. I, I feel like it was a some coordinate thing messed up. You know what I'm saying? And that's another thing that he explained to me. He it, 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 it's like the knowledge is crazy because he was like, you know, humans make mistakes, right? So these things are gonna make mistakes because we're all made from God. We're all God creatures. We're not perfect. So. If coordinates got mixed up, they got mixed up. It doesn't change anything. Aliens in Miami, man. I was there. Fair Who was enough. I with? Hey, look, what's my slogan? Me, my two cousins, and my homegirl. Yeah, don't forget that. Fair Good enough. First, man. So one final thing is, obviously, there was another guy who uh, posted his story, claimed, mm -hmm. to, claimed to be there. He then, like 24 hours later, said he was trolling. Wasn't true. But yep. then there's a whole conspiracy about he was told to yep. take it down, he was paid off, whatever. Yep. Are you fearful of something like that potentially happening to you? Like being nah, silenced. Uh, nah, because you want me to tell you, you want me to tell you, I'm gonna break down what happened with him, right? And I don't know him, but shout out to him, you know what I'm saying? He said he was trolling, that's cool. But listen though, this was what you did. You took an opportunity that you had to uh basically do whatever that you wanted to because the whole world had got on it. He could have just kept on going with his story and had blew up major i mean mm. like you really crushed all that when you just sat there and said no this didn't happen i would have kept my mouth shut and just kept on rolling now am i doing that no i'm telling you guys aliens in miami i was there king sosa man i'm trying to tell you bro this it, this is this has got to be the best uh interview out right now man 2024 bro i'm I telling mean, you that, that's one thing that you always start your videos out with, like, I was there. Like, that's your thing right now, is I was there. Like, yeah, every video... I want, that, I, want, I, I want that to trend. I want that to trend, man. You know, I gotta make my own stuff. You know what I'm saying? I gotta have my own hashtags. I'm trying to break into the algorithm. Let me break this down to you, man. I, I like, man, I'm, I'm looking at this like one of my shots in life to do what I have to do. I want to get my platform to be able to showcase all my other talents that have been looked over anyway while I have attention. And if you think, if, if you want to call me a clout chaser, if you want to call me anything from that, that's on you. But you, you, what you do with your 24 hours and what I do with my 24 hours are two totally different things. I'm trying to change the narrative for my life, either way it goes. All right? Respected. And I'm not being negative. I'm not being negative. I don't have negative energy. And if you're wondering, I'm not one of those people that you can just walk up on thinking that you can just say anything or do anything too, man. I'm 
Trust me, bro. I one of them, man. I'm telling you, I'm here for real. Respect. Then, yeah, man. I gotta. I, I really, man. I really appreciate you, man, having me on here. But I really gotta go, man. No problem. Shout out to you, man. Shout out to you, man. Word. Shout out to you. And where can people find you? One last time. Where can people find you to continue okay, so, your story? So, okay, so on 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 YouTube, man. I've been trying to get my YouTube up there. So what you can do is follow me at Hood TV Experts. Hood TV Experts on YouTube. On any social media, all you have to do is type in Little Too Much 704. That's L I L number two much 704. All right. And then, like I said, I'm going to be dropping audio on, um, on on Spotify. Any 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 music that you stream your music for, I'm going to be dropping on there. So just type in. There'll King be links. So I'll put listen. some links in the description for it all. Yeah. Just type in King Sosa, 8 a.m. in Charlotte. For some reason, Apple Music still has my old name, which is Yacht Master Sosa. If you type in Yacht Master Sosa, then I'm going to come up, man. King Sosa, Yacht Master Sosa, man. Little too much 704. I was there. Aliens in Miami. I'm trying to tell you, man. Let's go, man. Y'all make sure y'all share this live. Y'all make sure y'all share this video. So there it is. The interview with the witness who was at Miami on January 1st when the whole alien thing went down. What do you make of this? Let me know down in the comments below. If you want to go and check out uh, King Sosa's social media platforms, there will be links in the description so you can go and follow his journey. Also, he has promised more footage, which we're going to be covering on this channel. But if you want to go and check it out first, be one of the first to see it, you need to go and follow his TikTok and other social media platforms. But I want to hear your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comments below. Uh, and while you're down there, be sure to jump to get the hell out of that like button. Subscribe if you're new and tickle my little bell so you get notified whenever we upload to this channel. I don't think this is going to be the end of it. I think we're going to be seeing a lot more before this dies down. Anyway, I hope that you guys have enjoyed and we'll speak to you later. Peace.